Good evening. I'm Christine Johnson. I'm Maurice Dubois. We begin with those shark attacks happening within minutes of each other at two separate beaches on Fire Island, about four and a half miles apart. CBS 2's Ali Bauman has the latest now from Bayshore in Suffolk County. Both children are expected to make full recoveries. They were swimming miles apart at two different Fire Island beaches, but within the same hour, the 12 year old girl and 13 year old boy became victims of what appear to be very rare shark attacks. I kind of thought it was a dream. I didn't really think it was actually happening. 12 year old Lola Polina, one of two grade school kids bitten by what appears to be a shark off Fire Island around noon Wednesday. Polina was waiting in shallow water at Sailor's Haven with her family. The water was cold, it was like not so I couldn't really feel anything. When the lifeguards were kind of, you know, like touching my legs, seeing like what happened, it hurt more. When I looked back, I see her like in the water, like struggling, her head, just her head kind of up. Polina's mother posted these photos on social media. Lifeguards bandaged Lola's leg and EMTs took her to the hospital. But just minutes later, about four and a half miles away, this 13 year old boy was boogie boarding at a day camp on Atlantic Beach when something latched onto his leg. I brought him out of the water. He had blood on his leg. EMTs pulled out this tooth from one of the deep gashes around his knee. He had several puncture holes uh, in the form of a bite. It was multi road indicative of a shark. I was so scared. I, I didn't think about it until we got out of the water and we saw him over by the lifeguards wrapping with his all, leg like, up. Blown his yeah, leg with all, we're blood all over see, the place. But... Wednesday evening, Governor Cuomo deployed environmental conservation officers to investigate the waters off Fire Island. Long Island officials call these two incidents incredibly rare, but say summer is shark mating season, so anything is possible. The uh, bull sharks, the other uh, uh, tiger the sand sharks, they're all breeding right now. I probably will go in the water because I really like like the beach and the ocean. But I'll be more careful. Well, Lola was actually signed up for that same day camp that the young boy was in later this month, and she still plans to attend. Those two beaches were closed for the rest of the day, and Long Island officials will reassess in the morning before reopening them to swimmers. From Bayshore, Long Island, Ali Bauman, CBS 2 News.